This project is based on the book Henri's Scissors by Jeanette Winter. In this book, we see the artist Henri Matisse try to find an alternative to painting. So he decides that he's going to have his assistants paint large pieces of paper and he cuts out shapes and then arranges them in and around and all over the place. So what we're gonna do today is we're just gonna have to cut out some shapes and we're gonna arrange them too. <clears throat> now I've already gone ahead, so here's some different shapes. Now the shapes can be organic or geometric. Organic means that they're inspired by nature. They don't really have uh, a name to them. It could be like a wavy shape or um, <clears throat> zigzaggy shape or something like that. But, um, and then you could also have some geometric shapes. Now geometric shapes are shapes that we know, like a circle or a square or a rectangle. So I'm gonna take all those shapes. I just wanted to show you them. And I just used regular scissors. If you don't have scissors, you can always tear your shapes out too. Um, and if you don't have construction paper, you can use crayons, markers, or paint and paint white pieces of paper let it dry then cut it out and then make your shapes from that so now what i have is just i've got a whole bunch of different shapes and um i'm just gonna arrange them on here so i i cut out one that i was actually thinking when i cut it out was like oh that would be a great um sun shape <clears throat> so and i'm gonna use i may have to cut and trim some things as i go so there's there's a little sun shape with some um and I've cut out some longer shapes. These are going to be the stems for my flowers. Since he was into, he called it a, a paper garden, I figured, why don't we make a little garden? So I've just got like a little circle there. And then I've cut out like these kind of teardrop shapes for the petals of a flower. It's a really simple project to do. But... I was a little inspired by that book, so I decided that that's, that would be a great little activity to do at home. Now, you don't want to do, you want to make sure, right, when you're at home, that you don't make too much of a mess. Try to use every little piece of paper that you cut. So I have some irregular little rectangles that are kind of pointy and stuff, and they're going to be like pieces of my grass all the way down here. And what's, what I like to do is I like kind of like to put everything on the paper before, before I glue it down. That way if I don't like something, I can go back and uh, rearrange it. Or if I find like a space <clears throat> and I'm not really sure what to do with that space, um, I can go back and cut out some more shapes. So like, I just finished all of that. So now I'm gonna get I'm going to cut out another one. This time I'm going to do a circle. A circular shape up here. And then maybe a bigger circle. And, you know, none of this is like... This is just if you want to have some fun today with collage. And make a little bird up there I have my little bird probably needs an eyeball so I would really love it if you guys if any of you decide that you're going to do this I would love to see your artwork so you can either send it to me here, or you can send it to my email at school, which you'll have to look up online, or you, it's just my whole name, or um, you could send it to your teachers and ask them to forward it to me. I'm in the process of trying to figure out a place where I could display the people, everybody's artwork so we could share what we're making. Got a little, here's a little leg. I guess he needs a wing, too. Mm. 
Mm, it doesn't matter if it's off the page a little bit right there. Um, so you can, and you can keep adding to this. You could add all kinds of stuff to it, but um, just have some fun. Create your own shape garden with organic and geometric shapes, and then arrange them on a piece of paper. When you're finished, you can glue all this down, take a photograph of it, send it to your teacher, send it to me. I would love to see any of the work that you guys produced today. All right, so have an awesome one.